Howdy folks. Saturday. Prospector trip here. How are you? I'm working on the, uh, the Tahoe, the gold rig. Uh, you got to keep your rig in functioning condition. Uh, what I did is I put a new uh, cat on this thing a little while back. Yeah, you can see there. Maybe mag flows there. I don't know if you can see them or not. I can't look at the camera like this. Anyway, uh, the seal right between them, uh, between the cat and the muffler, uh, is a little bit not flat. And uh, so it doesn't seal well. You can see a drip of water there, I hope. Anyway, um, I'm going to do something about that gasket today. I put that in and it leaks like a sieve. And of course, uh, if it gets bad enough, it fails. Uh, you know, my uh, O2 sensor. So I put a new gasket in it, but it's just too, uh, too much of a gap there. It blows exhaust right past it. And so anyway, we're going to fix that, I hope. I hope. <laughs> I hope we'll see the video, see if it's any, see if we can even see what I'm talking about. Anyway, I'll show you a little bit more in a minute. Okay, what I have here is I, uh, I ordered three of these online. And these ones are a little bit uh, thicker, tiny, tiny bit thicker than the one that I put in there. I bought at the auto parts store. And uh, the good part is I could get three of them for the same price at the auto parts store. <laughs> So, I'm thinking, uh, now that I got them here in my prospecting fingers, I'm thinking two of those will do fine. I don't think I need three, but I'll have a spare anyhow. So, I think what I'm going to do is uh, take them out of the packaging, obviously. I'm going to use this. This is good to about 500 degrees. And I'm going to goo these two guys together. And uh, I'm going to coat the outside, too. Uh, completely let them dry. And then once they're dry, then I'll install them. So that'll be a little while from now. You have a great day. I will talk to you and I'll show you what I'm doing here in a few minutes. Bye. Okay, I got these things laid out here. And uh, newspaper, and I got my copper spray gasket. All shook up, baby. All shook up. I'll give them a little coat here. See what we got here. See if I can paint and hold this in the right spot. It's just like painting, kind of. I don't want to put on too thick of a coat, however, I do want it to uh, seal. <laughs> That's kind of an important fact. So we'll ooge it pretty good here. Let it dry. We'll slap those two muggers together and see what happens. I don't know, maybe I should stick them together while they're wet, but I think I'm going to wait till it dries a little bit. Probably spray them real quick again, then stick them together once it's dry. And that's right, that looks pretty good. I'll leave it right there for now. Okay, we'll spin that bolt out. This one here. And that one there, I don't know if you can see it, it's pretty. Oh, yeah, there it is, right there. Yeah, it's hard to see. Anyway, it's right there. Let's get those out. Okay, there's the. Uh, Oh, gasket, my gnarly bolts. Yeah, this thing uh, is basically in there like uh, this. Just like that. Uh, actually, no, it's like this. Uh, backwards. Like that. So, yeah, that thing's blowing right past. Papashita, you're too close. You're too close. Your face is just too close to me. <laughs> okay, back off. Back off, man. I'm talking. Hey, cha cha cha. Ha cha cha cha. Hold on. Anyway, it's obviously blowing past this area here big time, so I'm hoping double thickness, you know, will do it. It uh, looks like the exact same gasket. <laughs> anyway, uh, it's blowing out up here too a little bit, so it's leaking on the top, and it's leaking a little bit here. I can see it's just not nearly as bad. But anyway, uh, I'm hoping too good with that uh, copper spray on to cut it. Anyway, and we'll see what happens. All right, I decided to, uh, they weren't quite dry, but uh, I got them here. It's being smashed by this old saw blade. Um, 
And so they weren't, it's still a tiny bit tacky here. And I think that's a good time to glue these guys together. And uh, of course I want them to seal well. So we'll let those sit for a few minutes here and then we'll play around with it some more. Okay, these guys have been clamped for a few minutes and I think we got them stuck together fairly well. So let's see what we got here. It's hard this video stuff without uh, having two hands, you know what I mean? <laughs> Yeah, it's just hard, man. I feel like I got like six fingers in each hand and no thumb or something. What's wrong with me? There we go. Okay, nail. Let's see what this dude looks like. Oh, so it looks great. Oh, so this looks pretty stuck. I want to do the outsides here. And then we'll glue that baby back in there and see what happens. That should do it, I'd have to say, twice as thick. Hopefully, hopefully I don't have to buy three more or something for 20 bucks and uh, and do it again. Let's see how hopefully it lasts a couple years. Okay, I'll paint it here and see what happens. All right, there she be. <laughs> yeah, hang them high, man. Get that side nice and gushy. And this side, oh, oh my gosh. Pretty fast. Anyway, there she is. Let her dry for about 15, 20 minutes and it won't stall her. And she's not quite so tacky. Yeah, I tried to deal with it, but it's uh, it's too sticky still, so I gotta wait about another half hour. So maybe I'll break some more rocks, I don't know. Okay, no leaks. Best I can tell, no leaks. All right. Come in, baby. I'll just fix it. Okay. Well, we got the old Teja up and running again. Of course, it was running before. It just had a little leak in the exhaust there, but uh, she good now, baby. Mm -hmm. Well, seemed to work so far. That uh, it looks like the flange for the muffler is, uh, you know, the piece that was on it before. The cap looks fine, but uh, it's just maybe a tiny bit bent or whatever. Anyway, it worked. And for my gold extraction from rocks today. Uh, yeah, we got a couple of little flakes, but um, like I said, it's a learning uh, issue for me. You know, I'm trying to figure out what is what, who is who, and and when I got a good rock, what that means. And uh, yeah, and it's a total freaking mess in here. Yes, it is. That's how I like it. Inspector Chip, trip, check it out. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs>